I now invite our first speaker of the proposing team, Ms. Shanice Lewis. Address this 
question, we know that we should rely on a business community who knows what they need from, from employees, how they would like them to be trained, and what kind of training would enable our youth to perform adequately out of high school or college within the business sector. Based on a, service, a survey by the Caribbean Knowledge and Learning Network in 2006, the graph entitled Employer's Assessment of Most Desired Skills set over set rank over 70% of the following honesty and integrity. Students are given the opportunity to observe the processes in the bank and to participate in the training opportunities that earned many of them job offers. In fact, one of the college's own five students, Karim Tedesford, currently works at the Republic Bank, having come out of that same program. The benefits of Claire, Madam Chairperson, it is also a fact that one of our most highly recognized schools, the St. Joseph, to go out into the corporate sector to get what they refer to as job training. This shows, Madam Chairperson, that they too are aware of the fact that the corporate sector has a fundamental responsibility to train and educate our young people. And now, Madam Chairperson, I leave my most worthy country to elaborate on what I have just said. But no, for this, there will be no doubt in your mind that our, our corporate sector has a fundamental responsibility in training and educating our youth. I thank you.